Southern Victoria can be a dry place. The Millennium Drought showed the need and importance of a diversified water supply system. To secure Melbourne's water supplies and cater for a growing population, a rainfall independent desalination plant was built. By using desalinated water, the demand on Melbourne's other storages is reduced. This allows our storages to recover and provides resilience when our communities are faced with future dry conditions. Desalinated water will travel to Cardinia, where it will be mixed with water from the catchments and transferred to Mornington Peninsula and suburban Melbourne. In the longer term, desalinated water could play a wider role. Desalinated water could be used to support towns like Cowes, San Remo, Wonthaggi and Inverloch, ensuring residents and holiday makers have a reliable supply of water. When Gippsland is dry, Towns like Warrigal and Druin are able to extract water from Tarago Reservoir under an existing supply agreement. Geelong can be supplied from the Melbourne system via the Melbourne to Geelong pipeline, increasing its supply sources and freeing up Lau Lau Reservoir to better support regional cities like Ballarat. The Victorian desalination project could enable the supply of additional water to the rapidly growing areas of Sunbury, Melton and Bacchus Marsh. A diversified and integrated water system will provide our region with the resilience needed to maintain a safe, secure and high quality water supply now and for future generations.